decided to loudly and publicly attack Joe Biden's policies, his policies on immigration or COVID or transgender athletes. If you kept talking like that, you would likely be silenced by Joe Biden's allies in Silicon Valley. If you kept it up, you might very well have to hire armed bodyguards. That's common in the U.S. Ask around. But it's unknown in Hungary. You have to defend your people against any danger. And you think you have a right to do that? Of course. That's got from the, it's coming from the God. Post-Christian, post-national societies, different communities, even huge number of, let's say, Muslim communities, hmm. and the original inhabitant, let's say, Christian communities are mixed up. We Hungarians decided not to take that risk, to mix up our society. Many hundreds of thousands of migrants into her country. Millions, N basically. Millions, non-German speakers, mostly Muslim. What have the effects been in Germany? You know, diplomacy is... Uh, and if it doesn't go down well, you can always use the pouty face. Requires, requires some bad behavior. But it was their decision. They took the risk, and now they got what they have deserved. So I can see chances in the Western countries also that they are able to change their policy from liberal to conservative, or from liberal leftist to Christian Democrats. The chance is there, but we are not internationally well organized. So the forthcoming years are really exciting. That's not just wrong, it's insane. 